Let's dive into another micro SaaS case study. Today, we'll be taking a look at the popular Twitter product called Hype Fury, and it's gonna be your personal assistant to grow and monetize your Twitter audience, allowing you to create new content seamlessly, grow your audience, grow your email list, and sell more product. So let's dive into this product, what it's about, where it gets its traffic from, and how it started, so you can learn from successful micro SaaSes out there. Before I dive into it, if you're interested in starting your own micro SaaS, I'll show you how to build one that will generate money and revenue in just 30 days, so you can go from discovering your micro SaaS idea to getting your first customer. There's a link in the description below. This is my very own course sharing the lessons, tips, and tricks in six easy to understand modules. And this is everything I've learned over the last several years of running my own micro SaaS products and generating hundreds of thousands of dollars in revenue. So make sure you check out the link below. Let's go into the back story of Hype Fury. So this article was written in 2021. At that point, they're sitting around 23K in MRR. And I have to imagine it has grown significantly since then based on their traffic volume. So in terms of their MVP, it took just three days to build the basic features. And it started from a problem they discovered in 2019. And there was no way to schedule threads on Twitter. So even asked about it on Twitter, nothing came up. And so there were existing tools out there such as Buffer and Hootsuite, which allowed individual tweets but not threads. And threads are really popular on Twitter to help gain engagement and followers as you can basically just combine a bunch of tweets together, allowing for more long form content. At the beginning, he was doing things that don't scale. He was reaching out, cold emailing, cold DMing, asking for introductions. And it was a very powerful growth technique at the beginning as they were even doing one-to-one -one demos. And for everyone they talked to, those people would then introduce them to two to three more people that would be ideal for the product. And he was giving demos from 30 minutes to an hour, sometimes two hours long. Now, if you were to try to do that for hundreds of customers, that's extremely time consuming. But at the beginning, it's so important as he was learning so much about his customers, what they would want and what they wouldn't want. In terms of their growth strategies, they have three of them. The first one was gonna be organic search. At the time, it was bringing around 45,000 visitors every month. They used Twitter itself. They tweet very often and plug in their free Twitter growth tool and just Twitter word of mouth. People would see Hype Fury label on tweets from influential accounts and they were naturally drawn to the product from there. If we take a look at SimilarWeb, we can get an idea of their traffic. You can see in total, they have around 500,000 total visits. And if we go to some of their recent engagement, we can see around 20,000 visitors a month here. As you can see, it's slowly increasing. And in terms of their traffic, they're gonna be most popular in the US, India, and the United Kingdom. And they're really most popular with that 18 to 44 demographic. Definitely getting a lot of traffic here. Let's dive into their pricing here. This will give us an idea of how they're generating money on which different types of plans. You can see they do have a free one, giving you quite a bit of content so you can test out Hype Fury, making it easy to see the value from there. And then they're gonna have small creators and a premium plan for up to six Twitter accounts. It'll be a monthly basis here, very similar to most other SaaS products and charging a monthly plan or an annual plan is great because you're gonna get that recurring revenue for the business, making it easy for it to scale to larger numbers. So this is gonna conclude the video here on Hype Fury, another micro SaaS case study. If you enjoyed the video, I would love it so much if you hit that like and subscribe button below. If you have any suggestions for any other micro SaaS products you'd like me to cover, let me know in the comments as well. I want to mention the Solo SaaS Academy one more time. I'll show you how to build a money-making micro SaaS in just 30 days. So check out the link in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in our next video.